Hey guys, Ninja Fairy here. Welcome back to my channel. This episode, we are going to continue in our white key quest, unless something wishes to interrupt us, which hopefully something doesn't. I need to need to knock on some wood, because that was probably not a good thing to say. Anyways, right now I'm on Cetacea looking for the Mangle Grow Railway Station, and I believe it's the one over here, maybe. I mean, I don't remember. Yes. So there is, um, this is white key number 12, maybe. Should be. It should be. If it's not, then I don't know. <laughs> you don't know then. Um, but anyways, if we come into here, yeah, at the very bottom, there is white key door. So I've been in here before. There is a lot of bloody hands. And you can get, like, some huge, um, this is like one of the best, best places to come for XP farming. As long as you know where to, uh, not die from. This is like a no running zone. This is a run zone. Okay, anyways, there's a white door here, so let's hop on in. Hello. What, what do you have? Oh, chrono crystals. That's like. Why did you do that? You see nothing. <laughs> those those are not fun things to fight. Okay, um, so that is number twelve. Nice and easy. I hope you guys got a good idea of where this is located. I'll show you um where it is. It's right over here. Okay, on to number thirteen. Okay, guys, we are at the Hato Step. But don't forget this part, Northern Railway Station. Northern, because there's a Southern and then there's a Northern. We're at the Northern one. I am repeating this because I failed for a little bit because I did not know it was the Northern one. Um, but anyways, we're here and there is, oh yeah, by the way, the location of this is right here. It's- this is this is a really pretty place. With all the dragons, all the stuff with wings. Or should have wings, I should say. Huh. Okay. So there's the thing over there, and those are all the things that I want to avoid, so we're- we're gonna go- we're gonna go over here. Uh, anyways, yes. Hello. Oh, I see you, Mr. Chest. Sizzling Styles. Inferno Blades. Flame ta Tangs. And Flame Boomerangs. Alright, I'm interested about the full- Oh. Okay, and all the other stuff as well. How do you get back there? How about we try the, the other side without getting stuck? Oh, this is like the fourth book now? Even more dragony designs. Red Dragon Roads, Wire Wands. Ah, that's what we have Serena on right now. We need like wire heavy wands. That's what we need. Okay, well, anyways, so that's this place. Um, see you all at number 13? Yeah, 13. Okay, guys, we are in the very cold and frigid Sniffleheim Railway Station. It, it, whoops, not Zoom. <laughs> um, we are all the way up here. So we're at, like, the very tippy-tippy top. If you want to know what's at, um, the left-hand corner edge of the world, now you know. It's, it's ice and snow. That's what's here. Nothing else. How did that thing s Did it see me? <gasps> no, there's a dragon! There's dragons. I don't know what else is here, but there's a lot of stuff. And chests! These places always have chests. Always look around for them, because you will find them. And apparently recipe books. Sets of imperial attire and robes. Wow. We're getting them all, honestly. Let me get it, I'll pick you 
up later, I swear. Okay, let me, let me go. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'm sorry for taunting you. <laughs> oh, that, that gave me a, that that gave me a scare. Another one. Sage advice. Supreme sage staves. Mitts. Robes of protection. Cool. Hello, little guys. Oh, we can't pet them? I wanted to pet them. Let's grab this real quickly and get out of here. Okay, thanks. 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 Love you back in. No, let me back in. I want back in. No. No. Okay, we're safe. I'm just checking around the back just to make sure there ain't any anything extra trying to hide behind me. Okay, see you all at number 14. Yeah. Okay guys, this is number 14, and we're at Camp Champs, Champ, Champ, Savage. I almost want to say Camps, and now I'm trying to make sure that I don't say Camps. So Champs, I don't, I don't think Champs is right. Chomps, Champ, Chomps is Savage? No, none of them sound right. Well anyways, we got a nice little white door over here, so let's see what's in it. Okay. <gasps> oh, oh, they gave me three mini medals. I love you too. Oh my gosh. Yes! That is the best. I want all of the mini medals. All of the mini medals. Sorry, I'm just like, I'm checking for anything extra. Okay, guys, this should be the last one. See y'all there. Oh, whoops, I, got, I forgot to show this, where this is because this took me a, a pretty long time to find. So we are right over... Okay, we're not at the glowing thing with the star. So we're right over there. Okay, see y'all at the next one. <laughs> for real this time. Guys, I'm sorry I have lied to you. That was number 15, apparently. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know where I got my, my counting messed up. I think I had my counting messed up the entire time, probably. Okay, but anyways, oh my gosh, look, we took a heroic stance. I love it. <laughs> okay, so anyways, I'm going to be on the lookout for anything extra before we go and we try to find all of the extra little seedlings that are just hanging out around at the pink areas. Because as we were on Cetacea, there was a lot of those. So I want to go see what we can find for them. Because I'm curious. Also, I thought there was like... I thought there was something here, but I guess maybe not. I don't know. I'm I'm just checking something right now. Um, but anyways, yeah, I'll I'll be on my way real quickly. I, I just want to see what's over this bridge. That's all. And I got nothing. That's fine. Okay, see you all at the first seedling. Oh, so we have to go to Angry La. And once you teleport over to Angula, look what you find! It's a little seedling! Um, when you're on Cetacea, you can actually- there's two of the pink bubbles, but then the third one's not there. Touch the seed! Seedling. Did I say seeding or seedling? Probably seedling. Cool though! Cool, cool, cool. Hi. Okay, we've already seen this. I want them to give us like um, a good screen up of Serenica so we can like compare it to Veronica and Serena. Um, does she look like Serena and Veronica? Sort of. I'll give her a sort of. <gasps> Cetacea! Hello! We did not get much out of that. Oh, besides for a white room. Yes, I see the white room around us and that. Uh, yes. Yes. That man. The mark on his hand. Oh, you don't think. Hmm. Aye, I, I do. And I have a feeling you've the same instinct, Lanny, eh? That was Erdwin, the luminary of legend. Aye, this is like deja vu right here. Well, we've seen that they forged the sword of light together. But that doesn't tell us what happened with Edwin's lantern. Yeah. We need another seedling, laddie. Okay, this seedling. 
Okay. Fun. Let's not go into angry law. Okay, I'll see y'all the second seedling. Wow, that's cool. Okay. Okay, guys, because there, there's a tiger good chasing after me. We're going right to the seedling. Oh, phew, the tiger did not follow us. <laughs> hmm, let's see what we find. Hi, Cetacea, you're so beautiful. Oh, she's the one who did the flute. Hey, sort of light. Oh, <gasps> oh my gosh, Cetacea! <gasps> Did you see that? Yeah. One well dressed whale. Yeah. Cetacea <gasps> looked very tough all of a sudden. <laughs> Yeah. I suspect it might. <gasps> How do we do it though? Well, let's not jump to conclusions. First, we need to see what the next seedling has to show us. Mm-hmm. Agreed. Okay. Well, you heard the gal. I'll see y'all the next one. Okay, guys. We're at the last one, Laguna de Gondolia. They're all railway stations now. Nothing will ever be not, not a railway railway station anymore. Oh. Look at them on Cetacea! Oh my gosh! Look at them go! <gasps> yes, Cetacea with the unicorn horn! Get it! Oh! <laughs> that's scary! Everyone say that's freaky! Cetacea we saw, wasn't it? Flying toward the dark star. Mm -hmm. I suppose that means she really was the key to breaking through to the Dark One. But what exactly do we need to do to dress her up like the old heroes did? Raise her sword! In another pickle, are we? <gasps> See her! Hello! Hi! Where did you spring from? Good question. If you're looking to give Cetacea a little more oomph, you'll be needing the help of the Sage. Serenica. Yes! Yes! We have made it to this part! Which will require another memory. Yes, it will. Another one? But we visited all the seedlings. Have we, though? Come a little closer, would you, Veronica, dear? My eyes aren't what they used to be. Are they, though? <laughs> yes. You're not quite as you should be, are you? <gasps> Guys! Why does that matter? Here. Pop this on for me. Oh no. Guys! Guys! Oh goodness. What's this gonna do? Guys, 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 guys. <gasps> no! No, I want to keep Veronica as she is, though! Is Veronica gonna grow up? I don't remember this, but I want to see it! <gasps> Veronica, honey? Oh. Is it really you? Well, I'll be. Oh my gosh. <gasps> OMG! Veronica, turn around! <laughs> They're twins! <laughs> oh my gosh, they're twins! Now they're twins! <laughs> yes, everyone marvel at this. Destiny is to guide the luminary. When the two of you get together and pray with all your hearts, well, then miracles can happen. Mm. But this wasn't possible with Veronica in her reduced state. Veronica's grown up people. Who are you? Who are you really? Now, are you ready to fulfill? Yep. Whoops. Mm. 
That is so interesting. OMG, is Veronica taller? Veronica totally looks like she's taller than Serena. OMG. Isn't Veronica the older one, too? Oh, that's pretty. Oh my gosh, they're making a tree. Yep, make that tree. Make that tree. Do it. I love it. Who knows? Uh, I think it means they've turned into a tree? Uh, <laughs> Come closer, Luminary. The tree has something to show you. Oh, sure, let's go. Move. I wish you sprint! Ta -ta! Yeah, who even knows where we are? This is familiar, though, and once we get out, I'll show you guys what I mean by familiar. I want to hear Erdwin talk. My goodness, friend turned enemy. guys think that there is any connections to any other boss that we might have fought? Guess what there is. Sorry, Serenica. Yes, people, what a thing! Bigger. Betrayed by the very man he trusted most. Does it sound similar, Hendy? of legend died. The poor thing. Please don't sound behind the back right now. The tree is still <laughs> glowing. I see. I rather think it might have more to show you. Yeah. Let us go. Let us talk to Dwee. Your beer. What do you have to show us? Oh, I look, all the little guys. Oh, what is, what's that? No weapon save the sword of light may end the dark one's life. Cannot be used. No luminary now. Only he may wield. Oh my gosh, look at it. Serenica's wand. It, whoops, sorry guys. That the thing that was on the outside of it? <gasps> oh! Look at that! So, I guess it's not as much as Erdwin's star, but more like um, Serenica's star right there. Wow! 
So they sealed it, but do not beat it. What doth the future hold for thee? The sword of light belongeth with the world tree. I mean to bear it thence. Thereafter, I shall venture forth upon a quest. I shall seek him out. I shall find him. Hmm. There you go, world tree. Erdwin, my love, I will be reunited with thee. I swear it. Hmm. Oh. Oh, I wonder what um if she was inside that and that's why there was all those extra books. Cool. Oh, I love it. She now she's holding a sword. <laughs> She is at the wa the watchtower. What are you doing there, though? Hmm. Oh no, girl, don't do it. I need only shatter it and. Sorry. Hmm. Oh. What did I might have seen my face but once more before I passed? Hmm. Oh, <gasps> little white guy. Hello. Oh my gosh, they're so freaking cute. Yeah, what would happen if you were to die in the place of time? Like, what would happen? Oh. Wow. Okay. Hi. You're now a watcher little time guy gal time gal wow so that's who we were talking to crazy right so sad super sad so Erdwin's lantern was no star nor was it the luminary's final resting place <laughs> no big no <laughs> Sorry, V. You've done as you were meant to do, Gellers. You've given the luminary the guidance he needed. Hmm. We saw it too. We saw what happened to Serenica. What she became. Hmm. She's still there, you know. Up in that tower. And she still holds the key to defeating the Dark One. I want to see us give a head How nod. You know about all this stuff, anyhow? Didn't it all happen centuries ago? <laughs> How indeed, my inquisitive young friend. Perhaps I had better show you. Sure. Okay. Huh? What? You? Morgan! Erdwin's erstwhile companion. <gasps> I do not remember this. Oh my gosh! What did all the stuff at the very end of the game? I don't remember. I remember the. I remember the stuff at the beginning of the game. Hello. Hello. A voice, you see. A voice inside my head. As it sounds like the seer. To smite the dark one. It spoke to me. Strike him down. Kill him, and I will grant you power beyond your wildest dreams. It worked out, didn't it? I tried to close my heart to those intoxicating words, but before I knew what was happening, my friend lay at my feet. 
Mord again. But even then, more kit, more again. It works. Darkness. In time, it took on its own form, and that is who stands before you now. Now, mm. Mordigan is defeated, and so I too must fade. But I have one last prophecy for you before I go. Okay. The timekeeper awaits you, Luminary. In a place north of the world tree. We know. The power of the watchers will take you there. We know. Go and give the dark one a hiding. And bring this story to an end. At last. Sure. So this is almost where I got to. We're getting like really close to where I almost finished off because I never completed this game. I'm excited to. Go see the watchers. Yeah. Let's do it! Ah, mighty magic boost. Magic burst pep power. That's cool. Okay, well, I'm gonna end this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I hope y'all enjoyed. I hope y'all have a great day. Ninja Fairy Watchers and Party out. See y'all later.